Hi, welcome to the demo session of Oracle Web Center Portal. Today, we are going to cover user creation process. In order to create users, we are going to perform these tasks. We'll start with the creation of wiki user in WebLogic admin UI. Then we'll log into Web Center Portal with the wiki user and we will enable the self registration link as well in Web Center Portal. After that, we will grant admin permissions to our newly created users and we will log into Web Center Portal as well. So let's start. Creation of Tom or Wiki user in WebLogic admin UI. Log into your WebLogic console at HTTP your host name colon port number slash console. Once you log into the WebLogic console, go, go on security realm link. Click on that and then you would be provided with my realm screen. Click on my realm. It would open a configuration page. Click on user and groups tab. Please refer the screenshot. In user and groups tab, you will see a list of already created users. In that list, you can click on the new button to add a new user. Make sure that you are the user tab. In the new user creation screen, enter the name of your user and enter the password and confirm the password. Click OK to create the new user. Verify your settings and your newly created user has been shown in the list. Now go on the groups tab of the user. This can be reached by double clicking on the user and then click on the group tab. You will see a list of privileges. In this list, select the administrators and move the administrator to chosen section. Click on save to save the settings. Verify the setting, updated successful message on the screen. Now, after creating the user in WebLogic, the next step is to verify the user login in WebCenter Portal. For that, log into WebCenter Portal at http colon slash slash hostname your port, which is generally is four time eight slash portal. You would be moved to the screen, enter the username and password and click sign in. You can verify that you are able to log into Web Center portal with the newly created user. You can access the user and the administration tab. So this is the theory. Now let's go to practical. We'll start with creating the user at WebLogic. For this, I log into my WebLogic by hostname port 7001 slash console. You can see I logged into WebLogic console. I'll enter my credentials. And I would be redirected to WebLogic screen. Now we have logged into WebLogic console. Now on the left hand side, click on the security realms. Once you click on the security realms, you would see a realm listing page. Here, see for my realm. Click on my realm and you will see the configurations. If you see above, you will see a list of tabs. In these tabs, you can find users and groups. And there you will see the all the group listed. Click on new and enter the username that you want to create. I will create wiki and enter the password. Now click on OK and your user would be created. 
you can see the newly created user now click on the user to add groups once you click on the user you can see four tabs click on the groups tab and you will see a list of groups now click on the administrator group and double click on this button in order to move administrator to the chosen field click on save now your user has been granted the administrated per group permissions now it would be able to log into web center portal now let's go to the web center portal page and we'll see that whether our newly created user is able to log in so i'll just enter my username which is wiki and i enter the password and i click on sign in now you can see the wiki user is able to log into web center portal and since it has administration group that's why it's able to log into administration portal as well and it can do the administration so this is how we create a user in web center portal through web logic i hope you like the tutorial and please visit our website 365 online training to know more about web center portal you can request for a personal demo session thank you for watching